after what I saw, what Usman did, it was him, to, his name is uh, Daniel uh, Chris uh, Wheat, Wheatman, UFC 161. You know, if I was Usman, I would have been like, yeah, boy, see what you did? He just ran into a wall. I mean, he should have really just run it in his face. I mean, he jumped on him after the dude's leg was broken because he tried to finish off that fight in the first 15 seconds, breaking his own leg on the other guy's leg. <laughs> it's really encouraged me to really run it in the face of police, prosecutors. Well, yeah, of course, my neurological disease not so much the police for their own crimes against me. Well, I mean, like 2008, obviously, you know, there's the big, you know, preaching the gospel thing, but for falling for the, the, the lies, you know, and it's really no excuse. And then, of course, the doctors. So, I, you know, you can't fault the doctors, but... It's the idea that, you know, oh, you're done, basically, you know. We could try stuff that I'm prescribing, of course, with, you know, various things that people are going to make money on. Which, disease, modifying drugs, they call them. I've really been thinking about this a lot. The whole issue with regard to how that dude just wiped that kid out when he was trying to go after it. Really nice legs. And the thing is, she's like thicker girl, not thick, but like, 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 like she looks strong, like you know, but impressive. I'll just show my hammer now, anyway. It's windy. I was trying to block the wind so that we can just get my voice, which is so important for these videos. I really need to get, you know, bolder. I mean, just imagine that though. This dude just. He was trying to hit the guy, and he <laughs> and he's he's all you know. The, I think it's Chris, Chris Weaving. He took out Anderson Silva's. I don't. I mean, I, I'm into MMA because I'm not really into it, but I mean, I, I do keep up with some things. Since it's just, it's on ESPN, I've watched a lot of ESPN things. I'm a, I really do like Dana White a lot. And he's of course he's a promoter. He's an entertainer guy. Don King did that. Don King did that. <laughs> so that's where we are over here. Yeah, obviously one of the big ones is you know, the police thing with regard to the whole carbon monoxide. And then of course... Their idea that their, their use of force is acceptable the way it was in, in certain situations. But still, I mean, the whole police, who the fuck do they think they are? Oh, you're operating under the 10th Amendment of the Constitution. What to do? And it's only for those people. It's got nothing to do with women back then. Even though you've amended it a little bit, nothing to do with Native Americans. No, I, I'm, it's, it's a selfie. Where are y'all from? Tampa, shout out to Tampa. I love black. I love the way blacks laugh too. They're, you know, blacks are more compassionate than these dumb fuck white people. Which is interesting, there's not too many white that are around right now. Because this is Daytona Beach, usually there's not usually more. So yeah, just you know what? I mean, I gotta get more. I gotta get bolder. I gotta get bolder. I'm gonna be getting 